Okay, here we are, house tour number three. So, uh, we got a new doorknob put on and uh, we took the grate off the window so you can see the nice original glass here. Um, so, we moved almost everything into the front room. You can tell almost the whole flooring is done. We've got most of the junk out. These are just the cabinets from the kitchen. We took out the closet underneath the stairs. It makes this feel a whole lot more open. You get right to the second door. Um, then, you go over here in the kitchen. The kitchen feels a whole lot bigger. Lack of counters and um, cabinets. So we actually took all the appliances to the dump. And then as you come back here, it's actually a whole lot lighter. You can see this wall has been taken out and all of the foam from the refrigerator room is gone. The contractor is going to come in and take this out and this wall here and the plumber is going to come in and do his thing. So, and we'll need a new window there. But you can see through, and there's a whole lot more light back here, so we can actually see what's going on. The servant stairs, which you can see there's a little bit of work in that corner with all the light sneaking in from the outside. But we can actually walk in here, and it's not even creepy, or there's no rotting mattresses, stuff like that. So, all the carpet's gone from upstairs, everything's been swept out. We have completely pulled out the bathroom upstairs. So it looks like there's some insulation needs to be replaced and um, they're gonna plumb this and we're gonna actually do everything up here. So it's actually a good view out here of the dumpster that we completely filled and have still not quite finished throwing stuff away. So we come in here to the kitchen Upstairs, this kitchen has been taken down. We're gonna use these cabinets downstairs in the laundry room. And then this set of cabinets right here is gonna be the kitchen island. So bedrooms look kind of the same. They're just without carpet. And more storage, getting things out of the way. So we go up the dark staircase to the third floor. We're gonna be able to see. It's a little bit more cleaned out. We found a couple extra things up here. Um, all the original wood trim and doors are now accessible. And we're gonna work on putting those back together when we sand the floors. There's no longer extra toilets up here. We actually did find extra cabinets that match the ones in the kitchen, um, which we have a friend on Third Street just down the road who has the same cabinets and is looking for a couple more. So we'll probably donate those to him. So let's keep going down this way. The stairs kind of have the, uh, the foam has been worn into the stairs a little bit. So we're gonna do some work on these before we uh, sand them and we have to replace that step right there. But overall, it's pretty good. The uh, floor, we always find nails that we missed. So we're hoping that we're gonna find all of them before it's done. So contractor starts you know, with electrical and plumbing and the roof, which so we'll get that fixed, which would be great. Um, this week, um, the plumbing guy we had a conversation with, let him know everything, where everything goes. So we're looking pretty good. Actually, you'll be able to see the dumpster out from here. So if we lift this guy up, you can see the backyard a little bit. So all that shrubbery out there will get taken care of and um, kind of make room for everything else. So um, we'll walk around outside. You'll be able to see the driveway. So you can see a little bit out here. We're kind of at the intersection right now. We cleared the wraparound porch. And you got all the roofers materials here. Really nice thing, uh, Emily and friend took care of the rest of the ivy, uh, which is all growing up on the foundation right here. 
Um, and so those are being chopped out and tossed away. Driveway's probably got room for three cars, maybe a carport in the future. But so we're gonna clear all of this out. Our property actually goes all the way up to the fence um, and then clear over this way. So you can see we've got another 10 or 15 feet of yard. So we'll clear that out, leave some of the major trees so we get a good divider between us and the family video that's back behind us. So there we go. House tour number three.